Okay, Earl, so really quick, tell us what your thoughts are on the new DC Comics logo. Ooh, alrighty. It reminds me of the DC logo that uh, the company was using back in the 70s. Very basic design. Uh, it looks like a font that you have that comes with basic word, you know, with Microsoft. It, it's a basic font. The C kind of looks like a G in some aspects. Um, I just wish it would be a little bit cleaner. Uh, maybe not merged into the circle so much. But that's not, not my real big beef with it is. This is the third logo we've had for DC inside of five, six years. Um, my favorite was the one with the DC, where it said DC and had the swirl behind it. Uh, then they came out with the new one where it was the DC and it was like the page was folding down. Uh, kind of looked like the Discovery Channel logo. Um, you know, that one actually grew on me in the end. Uh, much like this one, I'm sure will. Uh, I just wish there was a little bit more to it. The white in the background lends to be um, not really eye-catching. You need something there. I really like the ones they used from the late eight, late 70s throughout um, up until I want to say probably 2007 or so was the DC bullet where it was kind of uh, at a 45 degree angle and it had the bullets around it and it had color into it um, much more than this one when it's just the letters are colored uh, it's just going to take a little time to grow on me um, not my favorite DC logo I would say of uh, the last four we've had in the past 30 years, I would say it ranks number three. Right. So um, that's it, and we'll, uh, we'll actually see how it looks on comics this week when uh, DC Universe Rebirth number one comes out. So maybe, uh, maybe that'll change my opinion of it a little.